V8 supercar veteran Cameron McConville is getting ready to go up a gear by testing a Formula One machine. And his preparation has been fun. Today he had a crack at the world's fastest go-kart. Going fast isn't new to Cam McConville. He's used to barrelling around in a monster V8. But this is something altogether different. Anyone I've spoken to, any of the uh, F1 guys when we're in Singapore, they just said, get something that vibrates, shakes the insides out here, and that'll put you in good stead. So the, uh, the trusty go-kart's the best thing. To prepare for his Formula One test, he's trialling this little beast, but just squeezing in both the cart and an F1 cockpit presents the first hurdle. I've been doing a heap of running in the last month to try and drop two kilos to get into the seat. I physically couldn't get into Jensen Button's seat. They just have no hips and no bum, these guys. They're just sticks. Then it was time to wring the neck of the world's fastest go-kart. McConville started cautiously but eventually found a blistering pace. A top speed just on 130 k's an hour. It proved the perfect preparation for November 25 when the V8 veteran tests a current spec Honda F1 machine in Japan. The results to feature in Channel 10's Albert Park Grand Prix coverage. Get through, not make a complete deal of myself. Uh, it'll be, yeah, it's once in a lifetime opportunity. And not crash? I don't want to crash, that's first and foremost. We'll keep our fingers crossed.